It had copay. All the way from Canada, Russia. Aloha. 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 TV. You know, I was listening to a lot of your old albums as well as this one, the brand new one. Um, for some reason, I just started thinking about it. Yeah. Mm -hmm. They were a big influence on yeah, for a while. Sure. When we were, I mean, they were one of the first bands of real musicians that we uh, really admired. Very technical. It was very conceptual. And I had, they had a big impression on us. Unfortunately, they were still around while we were doing what we were doing. So, <laughs> you know, that, that influence showed up on our music. And it's very difficult when the people that are influencing you are still making records. So you're sort of... You know, you're sort of both existing and being the same at the same time. But, you know, that's, that's a natural part of uh, growing up as a, a writer and musician. Let's talk about uh, Canada. I've never been there. What's going on? Like, I need to just to record yeah, actually, the music scene, we don't spend a lot of time in Canada. I, mean, I guess. Uh, we're on the road about six or seven months of the year recording, so we're kind of out of touch, but the, uh, the music scene is pretty it's quite healthy, healthy right now. It's quite healthy, and it's, I guess the main music scene is, I guess, in Toronto, uh, Vancouver, I guess, I guess, I would say. In Salt and the other cities, but if they have a bus, I mean, it's, I'm not that aware of it. Uh, it's a pretty self-sufficient industry where at one point it was pretty dependent on the United States, but now there are a lot of artists in Canada that can exist in Canada and do pretty well. You know, at least, you know, uh, become sort of Canadian stars, I guess. How yeah. about this uh, big uh, English movement? What big like, you know, Culture Club. A lot of different bands are getting so popular in the United States side uh, as well as over here. Well, it seems to me that right now it's probably the, the weakest time for English music in the last 20 yeah. years. I don't really I see don't that big a flow of English music over to America. Really? For yeah. young kids, the, the, the few that you mentioned yeah, are, are more pop bands. Yeah. They're, they're not really groups that will revolutionize anything or really change anything. They're really mainstream pop bands. But most that of are inter very international in there. Most of the music right now is very pop oriented, mm -hmm. very singles oriented music coming in. But aside from the heavy metal movement, which is just heavy metal. Movement. It seems to me now that it's uh, a very weak time for rock music coming out of the music.